arrived with. But we are on to the final floor. Looks like we'll be facing the Jester again. We'll take a setup turn here. Although, having Flurry. Flurry, we should switch the color on. Beautiful, uh, beautiful swap. Let them do some work on each other. One moment, please. All right, so we're gonna leave this guy alive because hopefully, oh, he's acting second, so it's it's less important. But one down, one to go. Let's see, do I? I don't really have a way to to get him right now, so we'll just we'll just stack up some improvements. Oh, he's doing the Hurt Dukin. None of these look like they're what we need, though. We have a rest. We have plenty of things still to upgrade. Rope hook is on my list, but also is that other backstab? Let's get rope hook going. I think that that's uh, that's gonna bail us out. And then kind of feel like I'm gonna do the whole area here. Hey, happy panda, how goes it? It's good to see you as always. I think. This is a this is a painful fight for us for sure. We're gonna have to wait until we have some hit and run options. I probably should have made it so they both couldn't get in my in my face at the same time. But that's I think the best we can do. Cause I don't think do I stack up more bleed when I do that? I do not. But I can start that going. Yeah, I kind of, I kind of feel like that should, that should at least stack bleed. Oh no worries, I'm, I'm glad you, uh, you swung by even if only for a minute, Panda. It was, uh, was much appreciated as always. Huh, ground slam doesn't seem too bad here. If we're gonna ground slam, I think I wanna move to here. Then we'll grab the ground slam. I don't mind staying adjacent to this guy because I am planning to do him in. Wow, which may not happen. I was expecting Expecting a little more there. Okay, at least we got the guard break. I feel like I took a bunch of damage doing that, though. We don't have Alina H20, so I I have yet to uh, to beat the first difficulty. So I'm I'm a bit of a noob still, uh, Panda, but I uh, based on everything I've seen, I I imagine that is probably very difficult. Oh yeah, we do want to change Flurry, I think. 
But that, that would have been an insane amount of bleed. Watchful, I like. Can get us out of some sticky situations, and it doesn't harm our draw too much. Let's switch Flurry. I want it to be red. Oh, I don't think I've uh, I've ever fought this guy. Amplify. Increase HP by 4 at the start of each turn. Homing orb that deals 16 damage equal to its current HP. Okay, well this seems this seems bad, so I think the best thing that we can do is just go as insanely hard as we possibly can on this thing, right? Yeah, that seemed like the right play. Yak was concerned for a moment there. Protective Ward, gain one magic shield. I see, okay. Oh, so magic shield does that. That was a, that was a good fight for us, if nothing else. Do I like leverage? Do I like vigilant? I don't think zero zone. We we well, a lot of our card draw gets around it because it's not actually card draw. Zero zone might be worth. We're not running out of energy very frequently though. I think I'll hold off on it. We could go double knuckle daggers if we wanted to, but I don't think that's the play either. I'm going in pretty aggro at the moment on this big guy because in my experience that's this he's the one who in this fight really uh, causes problems. We have no zero cost so dupe's not going to do much for us. We might just have the kill here so I'm gonna Go for that, I think. Okay. Yes, we indeed did have the kill. Hmm. We still have ground slam in the deck. I think I think I'm probably more interested in going for the ground slam right now. Yeah, let let him do do some work on on the other ones. Okay. I I did not let him do any work on the other ones. But I think that's okay. Good gracious, we are uh, we are eliminating foes pretty uh, pretty handily here. That would be that would be greedy. Well, we still have two actions. Nah, we'd end up using all of them. So I think we just. Do that instead. Am 
Am I greeting right now? Yeah. Let's not do that. We can wait for the next turn to get the job done here. Every time you deal damage at a... Every time... Every six times you deal damage at a dark roll to hand. This power can be stacked to decrease the number of times required. Hmm. I think we skip. These guys have thorns, which is a little annoying. It, it seems like it would, Jace. I, I just don't know if... It, it seems really hard to get... Uh, to get enabled. I think we're going to move to here. Am I just going to kill myself on thorns this way? Mm, worse than I expected it to be. Need to be a little careful with the thorns, clearly. <laughs> Just grab a defend so we don't take the spiky damage. Actually, I think we can... We can't break the break it that way, so... Ah, eh, we'll take one damage here. I should have probably done it earlier. The burn stacks super high. I'm kind of surprised. Let's see, you're you're the one sitting for 18, so let's move out of the way of you. Let's start by doing this and getting some bleeds going, which will in turn make our heavy rain hit a lot harder. I don't know if guard break right at the end of the turn was worth it there, but... I'm super blown away by Fireballer. It seems seems very strong. I'm trying to decide what I'm looking for at this point. We don't have a money equals power, so I think... Oh, man. Do we go double, triple fist? Or do we just upgrade these two? That's 700 for these two upgrades. I think that might be the better play. Yeah, I think at this point, I think at this point, Hexanuckles, as uh, as Yak so eloquently put it, is probably uh, not worth it. Interrupt and apply to vulnerable. I really like this. If we can, if we can keep it for the final boss, the demon, that would be amazing. I think we just go for it. I, like, I don't think... Do we have any upgrades that I'm... The backstab upgrade would be nice. How much do we have to do to get to our first rest, though? Our last rest is here. We have to go through another elite. I don't think it's worth it. Okay, 
Okay, I think we just, we set up, we're, we're gonna accept that two of them are gonna pop, so that's fine. I think getting one out of the way right off the cuff, though, is probably extremely worth for making the fight a little more straightforward. I don't know. That I might have been spending uh spending a little aggressively on our power moves, but give me shuffle right now. Shuffle would be so perfect here. I mean, getting to here and just killing this guy is pretty good. Sure. That's too much. We we're we're doing okay enough as is. Yeah. Wow, that was that was insane. Our damage output is kind of crazy. At some point, I'm going to get Shuffle, too, here, which is going to feel really good. Um, oh, actually, this is perfect. I just need to land here. Let, let those two duke it out there, and then I can do a bit of a preparatory turn. Alright, now, we'll reinforced gear, and then I think I'm just going to do regular damage here. I'm not going to... I'm not going to do anything crazy. So who's hitting you? You're hitting you. I think the play is to move towards the Jester and shuffle. And then I actually think we want this to just stack up an absolutely obscene amount of bleeds. It's less damage, but I think the bleeds are totally worth it. Yeah, 18 bleeds feels pretty good. Should have should have played beef up earlier in the uh, in the the swing of things. Oh, I didn't know I was gonna get stunned there, but I guess good news for for the other side of things. Let's see. Yeah, I'm I'm pretty into it too. Uh, let's see. I think I think we just improvise this kill here. We'll play beef up, and then I mean, 37 damage is nothing to sneeze at. I feel like. Do I th we do we think we just have the kill with the right draw here? With him having 12 bleed? It's probably it's probably not worth trying to trying to rush things right now. We'll have a better opportunity, I think, soon. Oh, that flurry is probably said opportunity. Can we get there? 
I hate that I don't think we can. That's... That's some heartbreak right there. I, I should have moved here just to take less damage, but hindsight is unfortunately 2020. The rock does nothing, right? That's not gonna. That's not gonna stop you from doing anything. I guess it gets us one more block. I hate that I lost Fury there. This is uninterruptible. Uh, we also don't have any movement, though, so I think... We're just gonna do some work here. Alright. End of that fight really didn't go the way that I wanted it to. Now, is, it's not attacking the spot directly beneath it, right? But if I shuffle, am I actually solving my problem? I don't think I am. So I think I grab Ground Slam to GTFO. I guess I could have potentially also... Gosh. Right off the bat, I'm feeling very... I can kill the orbs for health. That's good to know. Uh, oh, I can pull to you. Okay, that's insanely fortunate. This is interruptible. I think we will be interrupting this. Our So far, our draws have been pretty horrifically bad, I feel like. It's 22 plus a knockback. I'm thinking about using the crippling dust right now into a uh, triple strike on backstab. I think I think we need to we need to move quickly and get things set up. So So that means next turn we should be able to... Okay, I can at least slam so I don't get... Well, what's the ordering here? Okay, that'll explode first. The slam for that much is a little spooky. I think we're gonna... I think we're guard breaking this turn though. Yeah, I think we are. We can only do 400 a turn or 300 a turn, right? So at some point, he's going to stop taking damage.
There's still that health potion on the floor, too. I haven't had an opportunity to get there. Uh, ooh, the flurry is badly timed, obviously. What are the chances that we get reinforced? The reinforced thing with it? Zero. Okay. Ah, uh, tooltip updates with damage remaining. Good to know, good to know. Hey, why'd he lose all that bleed and vulnerable? Game. Man, are we gonna lose again because shuffle comes the turn before he does the big attack? I'm gonna move here. Use the health pot. And then shuffle with this thing. Do we have... We don't have a zero cost in there yet. Uh, okay. Okay, he's got 200, but yeah, he's having our bleeds every turn, which is really uh, not part of my, not my favorite. I think we gotta, we gotta put the damage in when we can here. Fifty-eight is decidedly fatal. We have to do a hundred. We might have enough to defend, so I'm gonna do that. We'll start with this to get the bleed going. This does 39, that should interrupt, because it'll stun. Okay. I wish I had, like, one more reinforced gear, for sure. It's down to 127. Lots of ways to win here. Including that one. Oh boy. That right there is my first win against the demon. Ooh. Execute. Put an end to the target. Do I have another choice? Oh. Tony, thank you for your guidance. Father. <laughs> the the demon is my father. Oh no. I'll I'll leave him this time. Or will I? I am not merciful. Hmm. That was cool. I'm glad we finally got a W. Uh, a full no asterisk W. That was a, that was a very, very strong run. Uh, the 
the triple fists are as powerful as uh, I assumed they would be, and yeah, that combo deck worked really well. But yeah, thank you, Tony. Thank you, Swordmaster. Thank you, Yak. Jace as well. Yeah, it's been it's been a nice uh, a nice stream. And then, yes, I uh, I will need to I will need to duck out here. I wish I could stay for the credits, but unfortunately, uh, life is calling. We'll watch the credits the next time we beat the demon. Very nice. Ooh, new dif difficulty. Uh, Warlord difficulty cleared. New difficulty, Hellwalker. Interesting.